Hey, Lumi, how are you? Oh, hey, how are you? Good, good. How did you start your day today? Well, I started it out with, um, well, woke up, Bustelo coffee, obviously, getting that together um, and play some Frank Sinatra, that's life. I hear we're celebrating. Yes, it is um, a, a celebration year, pretty much for me. Yeah, so you want to toast with me? Sure. Okay. Cheers. A little rosé. Yeah. What's your favorite breakfast or brunch meal? Oof, steak and eggs, a little hefty, a little light, you know? Got it. Name three things you have in your purse at all times. Oof. Um, taser, lip liner, and money. What was your favorite age? Mm, favorite age, 17. It was definitely an adventure. It was, yeah, it was a wild year. What's a creative risk you've taken? Hmm. Well, recording um, like a passion project. Um, I recorded an album in my basement and put it out in 2021, right after the pandemic. What was it called? It was called 1013, which is also my birthday and the birthday of the producer who produced it. What was your favorite non-work vacation? Hmm. Favorite non-work vacation? Uh, man. Mexico? What part? Uh, eh, well, like everybody else from the hood, Cancun. <laughs> yeah. What was the first state you visited outside of New York? First state? Um, I would say Puerto Rico. I would have said Florida, but right, Puerto Rico is part of the states even though it feels like its own thing. Yeah, it is. But yeah, Puerto Rico. What was the first country you visited outside of the United States? Germany. How many best friends do you have? Oh, how many best friends? Best friends is such a weird thing. Ugh, I don't wanna, I, I can't do that. I'm gonna get in trouble. None. <laughs> I, have, I have great, like, lifetime people in my life, you know? Like, yeah, I don't have, like, flimsy people. That counts. Do any of your songs make you cry? Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, I have one that makes me cry. What song? Um, it's called Time. It's also on the 1013 album. I don't know, it just reminds me of, even though the lyrics have nothing to do with it, but it, it does remind me of um, people in my life who have passed on. It has that energy in it. What's something you learned that you wish someone told you earlier about the music industry? Oh. You're the boss of your own destiny, of your own, make your own choices, you know, yeah. If someone did a biopic of you, who would you want to play you? Ooh. Oh, that's good. <laughs> um, I don't want to, I don't want to butcher her name because I butcher everybody's name. Um, Alicia Cara, I feel like she definitely reminds me of a younger version of me, her whole style and everything. So that, that would be dope, yeah. Love that. What's the first movie that made you cry or very emotional? Oh, cool. um, man, I was really little, but um, La Bamba. Oh. What's your favorite album or mixtape to date? Mm. On my own. Um, Lumi, Lumi mixtape. Okay, these are gonna be some rapid fire questions. Answer whatever comes to mind first. Hair or makeup? Makeup. Hair up or hair down? Hair up because at the same time, you can have it a little up, a little down. Okay, when it comes to movies, comedy or drama? Oof, I like to laugh, definitely, but I am a drama queen on my own. So alone time, definitely drama. With somebody, comedy. Also movies again, horror or a musical? Oof, um, I'm not with the horror, so no, um, musical, yeah. In an airplane, aisle or window? Definitely window because I need to lean, take my naps, you know, yeah. When it comes to vacation, island or desert? Oof, um, islands. Well, thank you for letting me celebrate with you today. Oh my God, well, thank you for coming and thank you for celebrating with me. Cheers again. Cheers.